is you a very old, very old classic Tony Rice lick. Uh, I'm sure you've heard him do that before. I've taught it before on this channel too, but like I say, the new subscribers probably will never see that or missed it. So for uh, all you new subscribers that want this stuff, this is a very, very old Tony Rice lick. And it comes, it's in G. I'm doing it in G right now. You can do it in whatever chord. Of course with the capo. Anyways, first string, 10th fret. Uh, actually, let me do the lick for you slow first. Okay, so you're coming down here on the 10th fret, first string, pulling it off to the 8th fret, and then you're just going to play this G. It's like a D position. Uh, this position is what we're working out of. But this is like a D position, and it pulls off, and then plays that. Three, two, one. Uh, one, two, three. I'm sorry. And then it pulls off the first string from the uh, eighth to seventh fret. It's a second string on the eighth fret. Third string on the, uh, no, seventh fret. Uh, shit! Second string on the seventh fret. There. And then the third string on the eighth fret to the seventh. Now here you're going to reach down with your pinky and bar the third and fourth string at the tenth fret. Now if your action's not perfect, you may have a little trouble getting those clear. Uh, the reason I can't get them clear is because of this hand injury I have, uh, plus dystonia on top of that. Like the hand uh, dystonia wasn't enough. Anyways, moving on. Just barring uh, three and four at the tenth fret, and then coming back here on the third string to the seventh fret, and then fourth string, eighth fret, sliding to the ninth. And I assume you know that part. Tony Rice.